Seville Orange goes up, return flight and jet start down at the 1800 metre mark. Just about ready to go, just seven of them here. Set. Jet start, gate being closed behind. Ready. And away uh, they go. Good start for them. Jet start began well. On the outside of it, Seville Orange is up there with return flight along the inside sole of which is Pacey. Further back, it's a pretty border, Flickety by far. And that will leave at the back end of the field, Rouge Allure, just uh, four, five lengths off the leader now. Seville Orange looks to go on and take over the lead here. Seville Orange goes clear a length and a half from Jet start and along the inside sole of Wit. Return flight is looking to get close to the rail back in fourth. Races with pretty border. They four lengths off the leader. And another two lengths back to Flickety by far, racing in company with Rouge Allure. As they reach the 1,200 metres mark and it's Seville Orange. Clear by two lengths, Sol of which is second. Jet Start, the fancied runner back in third, is four lengths off the leader. Behind that is Pretty Border and Return Flight. And Flickety by far brings up the rear as they turn for home with Rouge Allure. They've got their six lengths to find here. Heading down towards the 800 metre mark, it's Seville Orange. Well, she likes being out in front. She's dictating matters. She leads by two from Sol of Witten second and Jet Start third. Pretty borders along the inside, four lengths to track down, followed a length by return flight. Flickety by far is five lengths off them and Rouge Allure, the yellow blinkers, races five and a half off the leader. As uh, the leader gets uh, away from them now, Seville Orange with 500 to go, clears away four lengths. Jet Start's been urged along with Soul of Wit. Pretty border down there inside. Return flight has got four to make up. Then came Flickety by far, and behind that one is Rouge Allure. Seville Orange the one to get to, 250 out by two and a half to three lengths. Return flight second. Jet start is back in third. Then Flickety by far and pretty border. Seville Orange continuing to roll. Return flight is now finishing strongly. Flickety by far is down the inside. Seville Orange down the inside is Flickety by far. Flickety by far got up. Flickety by far beats Seville Orange. Return flight then jet start. Behind that one, Rouge Allure, Soul of Witten, pretty border. Well, it's Gavin Larini struck up a good partnership with this uh, Flickety by far. Winning back-to-back -back races comes through along the inside of Seville Orange. She's dangerous out in front, Seville Orange. Return flight tried hard, but down the inside, the best turn of foot was Flickety by far's and David Nevenhazen's runner. Flickety by far, the colours of Alesh Naidu's fire racing trust gets up to beat him, Seville Orange by a neck. Another short head away to return flight. Jet Start was under pressure when they challenged. Couldn't pick up uh, to beat Seville Orange here. Behind that was Rouge Allure. Then came Soul of Wit and an indifferent run from the good-looking pretty border. So Seville Orange uh, continues to roll out in front, uh, going to the 200-metre marker. Flickety by Fars down the inside and return flight looking to get her act together on the outside. But it's going to go the way of David Nevenhazen's number four. Flickety by far, the daughter of Go Deputy, has won six times now from 26 starts. And she's certainly back to her best form. Second to Seville Orange, return flight, a close-up third. And Jet Start back in form. Number four, Flickety by far wins for David Nieberhazen. Gavin Larina aboard, top ride in DJ. This all certainly runs for Gavin. Well done here to the Fire Racing Trust and, of course, Laman Skral, who bred the daughter of Go Deputy. Beats number three, Civil Orange, very close up second. Third, the one return flight, a better run this afternoon. And back and forth, number two, Jet Start. You'd have to say very unlucky, literally couldn't run for the last 200. Four, three, one and two, that's how they run here, race six. I must say, Jet Start was in a bit of trouble there, though. I seem to be uh, struggling. Uh, it was getting there slowly, but seemed to need a lot of work. Uh, Jet Start, I think that was an under par performance, but um, it was a bit of a surprise to run the last time, but it was getting late. 
stops it just run below his pick the get start and with the red extra weight he was carrying Absolutely by Returning four. to the winners in closures, jockey Gavin Lorena riding back to back wins on number four Flickety by far, the five year old chestnut Lorena mare by Go Deputy again. out of the Western Wintermare Flickety, bred by the Lammerskrall Stud, owned Actually, by the Fire Racing Trust nominee, Mr. Lesh like Naidu. Well, the last trainer, David bring her on again. Flickety and by far, wins by a neck, beating home into second. By four. Number Looks three, like a, a Seville Orange. Third to number one, return more. flight. So I wouldn't rule that when, you know, two, any more start. runs out. Fifth was number I would six, stretch Rouge out another Alert. 200 metres next time. And I think you'd see a th a th the third win of the season. Well done to the winning connections. Flickety by far has now won back-to-back. -back. She's had six wins now from 26 starts. And in addition to those wins, she's had 10 places. I bet it's about 30 degrees out there, you know, and he's always wearing these big jumpers. The guy must be um, rock solid, hard as nails, wear jumpers on red hot days. It doesn't show a little bit, any bit of sweat on him whatsoever. <laughs> get the interview. Gavin Lorena interview coming up ladies and gentlemen. Flickety by far comes through to win race number six for David Niverhazen. Of course, this is the Fire Race Racing Trust and uh, bred by Lomond Skull and Gavin Arena, another top rider. Gavin, are you and the horse getting on quite well? Four runs for two wins? Yeah, very happy. Um, she won a nice race today. Uh, well done to Dave. He's backed up beautifully. Um, she felt well and it was great to get the win. Yeah, uh, two things. Um, one, you're riding very well, and secondly, I think uh, David falls into one of those categories of underrated trainer. Most definitely. He's a great horseman. Um, he puts a lot of time and effort into his horses, and they reap the rewards on the track. So well done to him and his, his family and his whole team. Well done to them. Well, you're getting winners all over the country, so well done. Just do what you do. Thanks very much, Mr. Cooper. Yeah, great to get the win. Big thank you to, to Alesh Nadu. Uh, lovely to, to ride him another winner. And let's hope you can send Dave some more horses. I'll well see it. Thank you. Thank you. Well then, to Gabe. Let's get David into the uh, picture here, man of the moment. Now, firstly, we were a little bit disappointed by Pretty Border because you and I both thought, thought she'd run better, but uh, this is a wonderful one. Yeah, look, uh, getting to Pretty Border, I, th I was expecting her to be right there. I actually thought she may have the better of uh, uh, Flickety um, today. Uh, she's run well at the Vol. All the wins come from here, but uh, look, Flickety, she's obviously in a good space now. Mm. Uh, Gabe obviously knows her well and thanks to Gav and um, look this is three wins out of uh, four over the distance um, so you know uh, we're learning all the time with her as well and uh, hopefully we can go on and uh, run in um, the Alouez Francais later on. 
Oh, well done to you. I'm sure they will be very happy with you. Nice training feet. Yeah, thanks very much. And a big thank you, Alesh. <laughs> Congratulations. Uh, I think he's over in India running the Mumbai Marathon or, yeah. or has or is going to. So thanks for the support and uh, congratulations. Thank you, David. Cheers. Thanks. Well done to David. And David always does give us the information. I told you what he thought. He did think the pretty border might have the better on Flickety, but he did say Flickety will be right there. So four, three, one, and two. That's how they run here. I will say it again. Number two jet start uh, was uh, continually bulk the last 200 meters. Couldn't go anywhere. So uh, has run back in that fourth position. That is the running of race number six. Good start for well, them. You can see that start began well. Be the outside floor. of it, Seville Orange is Another up there with return flight along the inside sole of which is, is Pacey. Further back at a pretty border, Flickety by far. That will leave at the back end of the field Rouge Allure just uh, four, five.